What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have signed our quarterback, Marcus Allen from Illinois, six foot, 190 pounds. He's a scrambler, okay? He can plug and play in this offense because I love me a scrambling quarterback. I'm not saying he's going to play year one. He might get registered. I don't know, but I know that he's coming to town. We have two tight ends that are looking at us, and I'm hoping we can get the both of them, maybe register one of them, maybe play both of them, maybe be like Aaron Hernandez and Gronkowski from back in the day. I'm just saying. So first down and 10, taking on the foes of Houston. Those Cougars, like this is turning to be a little bit of a rivalry, okay? And I'm starting to like it, okay? Good matchup, good teams, good uniforms, you know what I'm saying? Clash of colors and stuff like that, and I'm liking it. They died for the first down right there. Brown was not trying to get hit. He just wanted to pick up the first down. Then they run the ball. And we're not going to let him get nothing. Second down of 14. Looking now, feeling that thing fly. And we are all over. But, of course, the dreaded animation that's going to be either a fumble or a 15-yard face mask. That's it. It's either a fumble or a 15-yard face mask when you see that animation. It was a 15-yard face mask. They come back and they hit us with a three-yard pickup. We get some pressure. That pass was ugly. Ugly. Oh, don't even talk about that pass. It was embarrassing. Now they're going to drop it the pass one more time. And I'm like, how did we not tip that pass away? Montgomery making plays for Houston. My goodness gracious, the boy is a beast. Can't you tell? He can do it all. Then Benson, who's probably the fastest receiver, he makes a catch right there. And now they're looking at first and go, or first and 10, excuse me, inside the 20, so they're in the red zone. Brown, he's knocking down everybody as he picks up a first down, or not a first down, got halfway to the first down marker. But none of that matters because they crossed the goal line first. Houston is up 7 0. Are we going to take another L to this team? Taking a shot downfield to Smith. That pass was ugly. I thought Parker could make a play for me. I was wrong. Gonna hit him with a play fake on third down just because I like this play. And it doesn't work out. It, it doesn't work out, and I shouldn't do that. And I know what you're thinking. Audible to play or at least change the running back's animation. You can't. You can't do it. This game is phenomenal, but it's not perfect. I haven't found a perfect game. Maybe you have. I haven't, but this game is classic, and it's still the GOAT of college football, if you ask me. McCoy to the right side as we get the ball back after we give up a pick six. We pick up a solid game right there. We got to come back quick, fast, in a hurry. Dropping that thing off to Parker, who turns up field. Picks up a solid game. I'm liking it. Second down and three. Running the option, and Brad Lemon is loose. Picks up the first down, and we're up to the 40-yard line. We're playing solid football. Rolling out, taking a shot deep. That's to Williams. That pass falls incomplete. Holding on the play, so back it on up like a U-Haul truck. We need to get a big trunk play right here on first and 20, and we're going to do that. Heron makes the catch and gets dropped a couple of yards shy of the first down marker, but we're doing our thing. Second down and one from the 31. That pass, perfect to Thompson. Quinn Smith, I'm telling you, at home, the boy is like Joe Montana. On the road, he's like Montana Joe. I don't know. He's just not who he says he is, okay? McCoy, direct snap, crosses the goal line, touchdown, and the Tigers are on the board, baby. Montgomery trying to get loose. And Montgomery, he does get a loose, solid kick return right there. So they got some good field position, some decent field position. They run the ball with sharp, and sharp goes nowhere. My defense straight hunting. Second down, and my defense straight eating. Sullivan with the INT. And we got this thing going back the other way. Single back set, play fake one more time. Looking downfield, and wait, it's not working. Okay, that's my play, and it's just not working. Man to the outside, he's working, but the play ain't working. We got to change up our game plan. Will it be a passive from here on out type of day? Not with pressure like that. If the O-line's not going to block, we can't pass, okay? We're going to kick the ball, and the ball goes through the uprights as it should because my kicking skills have improved, and we are down by just four. They are back on the field. Montgomery, he makes a catch. Good tackling. That's all I ask for my DBs. Tackle. You might not be prime time. You're not, you might not be shut down, but tackle the football carrier, okay? That is going to be a fumble. We got the ball with excellent field position again. Man, maybe try to do too much right there, man. Got to hit the hole right there between the tackles and the guard. We didn't do it. We're in the pressure on second down. Looking out there for Thompson. No, for man who had it and then lost. That would have been a tough catch. Can't blame him. That's going to do it for the first quarter. So, we're at the 18. I'm rolling out with Smith. Hoping that somebody can get open. Williams did at the last second, but I held on to the ball. 
and we gotta set up for another field goal. So now we're only down by one, but I'm gonna take that after being down 14 nothing. okay? It looked like it was gonna be one of those games versus the Cougars, and I'm not trying to have that, okay? Believe it or not, man, we're trying to avoid losing back to bad games, believe it or not. I don't know if you were here for last week, but we actually lost, okay? So here we go. Third down to nine. Defense, I need you. Defense, I'm begging. Let's just stop him. Let's just stop him. He's going to take a shot deep. Has a man to open, and that pass falls incomplete, baby. What you going to do? Got to give me the football right back. That's the only thing you can do. We run the ball with man, and man should have been tackled for a loss, but he doesn't. He actually gets a nice carry for a nice game. Smith. Rolling out, we're gonna throw it to Williams, and he drops it. He's a he's a he's a lineman. I mean, hey, he was open, so I gave him a chance, but he let me down. Smith, tuck it and run, baby. Just do it yourself. Do it yourself, and he does. And we're up to the 42-yard line. First down and 10. There goes Brad Lemon taking it north and south, aka up the gut for a first down on this carry. And that's what I'm talking about, baby. Right up the gut. Back-to-back -back plays. Three carries. 26 yards for the homie Brad. Now, McCoy, he's getting busy. Direct snap. That's his money play, baby. And that's a first down for him. Three carries. About 36 yards for him. Lemon to the left side. And Lemon gets down a darn thing. What can we do on second down and 12? We can do plenty. Smith looking downfield. Rolling out. Stopping. Popping. Touchdown, Tigers, baby. That's how we do. We throw nothing but dimes out there. Dawkins. Dimes. Marvelous missiles. They're throwing passes straight to my dogs, and I'm going to take that. Matthews gets the INT, and what can we do with good field position? We can spin in our own backfield and get dropped for a loss of three. That's what we can do. Smith gets dropped again. So we might be out of field goal range at this point. Third down and 19. Rolling out of Smith. If we get anything, we can at least kick a field goal, and I'm waiting to throw the ball, and Thompson stopped running, and now we're forced to punt. If I just run for like a five-yard game with field goal range, but because it was third down and 19, turns into fourth down and 19, obviously, we decided to punt the football, okay? That's what we decided to do. And now, Houston, they take over with a chance to convert on second down and one. They burn a timeout, trying to score before the half is up. They're going to throw the ball, and that's going to be caught, and Benson is loose. Like I said, he might be their fastest receiver. Houston is known to have a pretty good track team. And that track speed shows here on Saturdays on the gridiron with their football team. Touchdown, and now we are taking L's again down by one. So here we go. Smith rolling out, still rolling, looking for Thompson, but we don't get the pass off. Can we avoid going three and out? The answer, the, the, the answer is... No, we cannot avoid going three and out. Heron, he had it. We all know 666 frame not 666 that no no we don't do that here but a 66 frame okay and it just didn't work out it just didn't work out but here comes houston yet again brown he makes a solid catch gets brought down to 45 and they're cooking with grease grandma's recipe in our territory burns picks up a gain of eight second down and two they're gonna run the option and they pick up a first down their quarterback knows what to do they're gonna run the option to the left side this time hangs on to the football gets brought down picks up a gain of seven Time is ticking away, and they keep running the football. Time will, time will stop because they pick up the first down. Seven seconds on the clock. Five seconds on the clock. Fumble, and they have one last timeout. They burn it right there. They were addicted to the option. It is what it is, though. They got to set up for a field goal. Kick is up. Kick is good. 24-20. Halftime score. The Cougars are on top. First down and 10, y'all. We have got to get something on. The passing game hasn't been bad, but it hasn't been great, and we're losing, and we cannot lose back-to-back -back games. We're still trying to be the number one team in this division so we can get to that Conference USA championship game. All right? All right. So, Wildcat. Okay, Josh Robinson. He's our quarterback. Wildcat offense. And in three plays, we're in their territory inside the 30. Robinson gets to carry again. And he's going to pick up another solid game. Second down. Eight yards to go. McCoy to the left side. And now might be time to pass it, right? You're right. Smith back in the ball game. Rolling out. Stopping. Popping. And it's going to be caught. Give me that user reception. Get straight. Moss. And now we're inside the two. We cross the goal line. One yard touchdown run. And it's 24 to 7. We're doing our thing. I don't want to keep saying that. But it's true. We're doing our thing. This game has been all kinds of ups and downs. Down by 14. Then we go on like a 20-point unanswered streak. And now here comes Houston right back. Benson, I'm telling you, the boy got track speed. And he's gone again. And we're down again. 31 to 27. But my thumbs are geniuses. And my brain, when it comes to this game, is pretty genius, okay? 
Okay, got our running back playing quarterback, Wildcat offense. They don't know who to defend. They don't know what to cover. McCoy loose. McCoy to the 50. McCoy steps out of bounds. That little dive that he did hit my foot and it pushed me out of bounds barely. Smith rolling out. We're going to keep it with the homie. Smith picks up a first down. Keep the chains moving. We're up to the 18-yard line. First down and 10. Man, he's getting bottled up today. It is what it is. It's a team game. Don't worry about it. Josh Robinson, he's not getting bottled up. Touchdown, Tigers and the Cougars. They should be worried, all right? 34-31. We're up by three. Defense, can we get a stop is the question. Benson, now he's showing that he can run routes, not just a speed guy, but maybe an all-around receiver. Montgomery, we know that he is, but he forgot his hands back in Houston. Second down and 10. Looking downfield. That pass, I was in position, but I hesitated, and Benson is loose. But Morgan, he got track speed, too, and he, play, and he plays safety. So you know, NFL scouts, they love that. Morgan, he'll be playing on Sundays, all right? Will anybody else be joining him on Sundays? Maybe not. I don't know. Third down and eight. Look at downfield. That pass, caught, but shy of the first down. So they got to set up for three. They're going to tie it up with the kick. Goes right through the uprights, and here we go. 34-34, minute 41 to go in the first, or in the third quarter, excuse me. Lemon to the outside, baby. Did, did you see it? It was all bottled up in the middle. Bounce it. Bounce it. Bounce it. I had a head coach yell, yell at my running back. I mean, something vicious. Bounce it. Bounce it. Like, I was like, okay. Like, I think he got it. He's just having a hard time bouncing it, coach. But I think he got it. Bounce it. Bounce it. I was like, oh, Lord. Smith to the left side. He knows how to bounce it. Bounce it. But he fumbled, fumbled. I got to have the ball on the other hand. I know that. It's fundamental football. And I'm not playing that sound right now when it comes to the fundamentals. But everything else. It's percolating. Everything is on time and on target. One the game. On time, on target. Man, up that gut. Takes it to the crib, boy. He take that thing to the crib. So vicious. Up the gut. They couldn't stop him. They couldn't stop him. We're up by seven. Defense, you know what time it is. Fumble. I'm going to take that. Third quarter comes soon in. Fourth quarter now. They're going to run the ball again with their huge hit by Sullivan. We're setting the tone on defense now. Third down and Twizel. Can they avoid going three and out? No, they cannot. Great tackle by Glover, and we are off the field. Man, up the gut again because he's a grown man. Try to stop him. You will stop him just fine in the first half, but now it's fourth quarter time. We done beat you up with the Wildcat, and now we bring in number 23, the closer. Man, up the gut. And man picks up another first down. 11 carries for him. Keep feeding him. He's hungry. Feed me, Seymour. Feed me. And he's going to pick up the first down, baby. 96 yards, about 68 after contact. He's having the Adrian Peterson type second half, baby. Let's go. First thing, go. Park is in the ball getting a big fullback. Try to let my big fullback eat. But hey, my boy, man, is he's not tired anymore. Okay, he was tired. So I took him out. But he's not tired. Gets into the end zone. Third rushing touchdown for him today. Adrian Peterson type that. I remember his freshman year, he had a thousand yards rushing after contact. Like, 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 that's crazy, okay? One of the best to ever do it. That pass is caught, and they're racing inside the 10 or the 40. Why am I saying the 10? I need a nap. They're going to be racing inside the 30. Now they're going to be racing inside the 20. They are racing inside the 10. That was a fancy play, and now Houston is down by just seven again. McCoy's in the ball game, and McCoy knows how to do it. My running backs know what to do. First down right there. Man, up the gut. Fourth quarter comes. He's just taking it right down your throat, baby. Up the gut. What you want to do? Man, he bounces it. That was a good call right there. Picks up a, picks up a four-yard gain. Then Josh Robinson whoop, makes a man miss. Look at the speed. My running backs are for real, baby. Okay, my running backs are for real. We have horses in the stables. First down and 10. That pass is broken up by Craig Williams. First time mentioning him. Second down and 10. That pass broken up by Brad Matthews. Already had a big hit today. Third down. Looking downfield. Takes a shot deep. And that pass falls incomplete. They got one more chance at the fourth down. Looking downfield. They're going to tuck in the run. And they're actually going to blow past me. I did not realize how fast he was. That was my mistake. I can admit that. So looking downfield one more time. And that pass to Morgan was perfect. INT for the free safety. That's going to do it. We win 55 to 41. A straight shootout. That's what you expect when you play a team like Houston. They got a whole bunch of speed. We tried to catch up and we did. And we got the win. 
Being down 14, what more could you ask for? Passing game, you saw the numbers. One completed five passes, but our ground game, that's where it's at. Three guys over 100 yards. Three guys. That's what I'm talking about. That's where our that's where our butter is bread or our bread is butter. That's where our bread is butter in the ground game, all right? That's how we handle business. And hopefully we can continue to handle business, turn this team into a flagship program here in Conference USA. So, Butler, he decides to come to town. 6'5", 264 pounds out of Florida. He could be a solid tight end. His tendency is blocking. I'm okay with that because we run the ball here and hopefully... Throughout his time here, we can teach him to catch the ball a little bit more efficiently. Next game, we're going to be taking on UCF. Now, I told y'all that we needed some help after losing to Rice. But Rice, they done lost another Conference USA game. So, we now leapfrog them in the standings. We're number one in the West. West side is the best side. I'm going to see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope that the rest of the day is the best of your day. Peace, love, hot sauce.